Hey YouTube, uh, this is uh, Rabbit Hammer posting a uh, pretty much a haul video. Um, my first uh, went out to a few stores today and uh, did some shopping. And uh, so I thought I'd share that with you guys. This is just uh, a few shots of my room here. I'm going to get the stuff ready and then uh, I'll uh, show you guys what I got. Uh, so the first thing that <coughs> came in today actually in the mail was uh, a couple Arnim Zola pieces here. Right arm and right leg. I did with uh, a trade with Big Hank on the uh, mucollectorclub.com board. Um, you know, all I was hearing about is how great of a community it is and... Um, I can say that, uh, yeah, I'm loving it there. You know, I made my post. I needed some those Build-A-Figure pieces, and I had some for trade, so, uh, yeah. And, uh, and they're here, and my, uh, my bath pieces I traded to Big Hank are on their way. So I just, you know, wanted to thank him for that, and I get to finish my Zola now. So that's cool. Um... Just for shits and giggles, I, uh, I bought another Phantom X. Um, now I'll have actually another Arnim Zola piece that I don't need. But uh, hey, maybe I can trade that to someone who does. Um, but uh, yeah, just uh, I'm going to mess around with this one. Um, my other one, the paint wasn't that great either. So, uh, you know, what the hell. I, I picked it up. I also picked up... Uh, Mohawk Gremlins Mogwai figure. Um, I don't have any Gremlins figures from from this NECA series. Um, just took me a while to want to buy any, but uh, I figured this is the one I want to get the most, and uh, so I, I snagged it. And from the new wave of Terminator NECA figures, I got uh, Liquid Nitrogen T1000. Uh, a very cool figure. Um, most likely gonna keep this mint on card for a while as I just have so many other um, T1000s open that you know the posability I, I got what you need from it from the other ones so this one probably just hang up on the wall. And uh, also from the new wave is the, the new T800 Tanker Truck Pursuit. Um, again, I'm probably going to leave this one on card because I have all the other ones opened. And it's all the same old. But, uh, you know, new head scope and all that. So, cool. I also picked up uh, a couple Predator figures. Uh, this one on the right, the Stalker, was uh, on sale. A little cheaper than usual. And, uh,. I love this Scout Predator. I mean, you know, part two body, part one armor. I think it just looks pretty nice. Um, but, like the Terminators, I have so many of these Predators now opened. Um, just to save on shelf space, I'm probably going to leave these guys carded and hang them on the wall. Because, you know, again, the other ones are just so similar. And I am starting to run out of room. So. Picked up Storm, Marvel Select. You know, and I'm not uh, super crazy about her, but, um, you know, I'll probably just stick her in my one pose and leave her like that. Um, I think she'll look good that way. Um, paint on mine seems pretty pretty good, and uh, I'm just really looking forward to Rhino and uh, Nightcrawler and Venom from Marvel Select. Um, things have been a bit slow select-wise for me. I wasn't huge fan of the new Hulk and uh, I've yet to try to get my hands on the uh, Fearsome Foes box set but um, anyway Storm now added to my select collection okay and the only Star Wars figure I picked up today was Dr. Evazan uh, from A New Hope great figure um, most of my classic Star Wars vintage collection is carded and on the wall, so uh, 
probably keep him carded as well. Uh, I need some Ponda Baba action now. I snagged this Juggernaut Colossus 2 pack today as well. Um, the Colossus paint is terrible, <clears throat> but I'm probably going to open this one and uh, repaint him the way he should be. At least the silver parts, um, chrome parts. The Juggernaut looks awesome. Uh, good to have one now without the helmet. Um, so picked up a few other MUs as well. Um, I actually didn't have a Silver Surfer, so uh, he was on the shelves at Walmart. So I I took it. Um, I also have uh, all the other MUs already but um, not opened except I do have the She-Hulk from the two-pack open but uh, just a great figure so I don't mind having a few and I just uh, went ahead and bit the bullet and I bought this five-pack um, oh six-pack <laughs> um, <clears throat> it was marked down a few more bucks now at Toys R Us it's like 45 so you know you're getting six figures it's a fair deal they had about five or six of them and the paint on pretty much all of them varied throughout the characters um, there's at least slop on one of them throughout all the all the boxes uh, I was looking at so I picked the best one I thought uh, was there and I'm pretty happy with the paint on all of them um, obviously just really wanting the angel figure um, but uh, yeah, the other figures are nice. I don't have Apocalypse opened yet. I have one mint on card, so I'll open this and get to pose them. Um, so yeah, good stuff there. So that uh, was my haul for today. Um, I got some beef jerky too. Oh yeah, oh spicy. Um, so yeah, good stuff. Um, I need shelves, I need shelves, I need shelves. I'm really running out of space. Storm's probably going to go up here. They're so lacked friends. Um, and don't laugh at me, but yep, there's all my six inch Marvel Legends crammed on that stupid cabinet. Um, I can't wait till I can display these guys better and 